Oh, hey. Beautiful fall day here in Old Town Alexandria. I'm Dave, and you're watching the Jones Restaurant Entertainment Guide. I'm supposed to meet my co-host, Maria, at November's featured restaurant, and of course, I'm late, so follow me. Hurry up. This is Maria, my very understanding co-host. You're late. I'll make it up to you. Who are you listening to? Herb Smith. Isn't he great? He's great. But you're still late. Okay, what if I told you the restaurant we're featuring serves up a good old mixture of southern comfort food, a relaxing atmosphere, has fast friendly service, and is the best little roadhouse in Virginia? Well, then you're forgiven, because King Street Blues is one of my favorite Old Town Alexandria restaurants. And since you're picking up the tab, how can I be mad at you? Actually, the joke's on her because King Street Blues has the best prices, and besides, our producer pays for everything anyway, so. I heard that, Dave. You're in big trouble again. I gotta learn to keep my big mouth shut. refers to King Street Blues as a three-story neighborhood. A neon decorated roadhouse that cooks up the classics of the 50s and 60s. The thing I like about this restaurant is the familiar, friendly feeling you get when you walk through the door. That's right. King Street Blues is truly an old town neighborhood restaurant and bar. Yeah, the mood is relaxing, mellow blues playing in the background, accompanied by a very sincere greeting from the staff. And that's what makes dining here so special, doesn't it? King Street Blues has so much character. If you've never dined here before, come on down and do so as soon as possible. And speaking of dining, let's take a peek at the menus. Which, by the way, is huge. Oh, that's King Street right. Blues literally has something for everyone. Oh, they've got classic southern traditional food like barbecue, ribs, chicken country fried steak, meatless, in addition to grilled fish and salads. Also, low fat, low cholesterol, and low calorie entrees, which of course translates into low Dr. Bills. But before we order, we want to introduce you to the chef here at King Street Blues. His name is John Jury, as well as one of the managers, Karen Foley. So come with us. And with us now are Chef John Jury and Manager Karen Foley. And we want to thank you for being here on R&E. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks. It's our pleasure. Can you tell us a little bit about the foods that patrons will experience here at King Street Blues? Sure. Uh, King Street Blues was originally founded on the concept of the old Southern style roadhouse. Now I have to ask, what is a roadhouse? I knew you'd ask. In back in the days of um, like pre-freeway, before the uh, international system, highway system, when roads were all two lane and people traveled greater distance from town to town, they became famished, very thirsty, needing restoratives. And the style of restaurant was basically the small mom and pop style with what you call comfort foods in this day. Um, homemade foods, basically, that would be a restorative for the people. So we've tried to maintain that sort of image here. Our menu basically has three sections to it. We offer barbecue, we offer the comfort style foods we mentioned, and we have a good for you section. Barbecues probably our most popular. We have our own in-house smoker. We smoke our own ribs our own chicken, we smoke our own pork butts for our sandwiches. Most of it's done overnight, very slowly, uh, with hickory chips, and they're all done in their own rib rubs. We feature our own barbecue sauce called mahogany sauce, which was developed here at the restaurant and is also available retail up and down the East Coast. And what about your legendary mashed potatoes? Yes, our garlic mashed potatoes, they are delicious. And we are uh, very well known for them. And they go extremely well, of course, with our uh, meatloaf. 
also with our country fried chicken and country fried steak, which are very popular. And we, of course, have our barbecue sandwiches. We have our Jake and our Elwood, which are named after the movie characters. Was that your idea? I uh, can't, uh, can't, can't say no, that, that was definitely mine. But uh, they come, of course, with our homemade potato chips, too, which are made here, and they are delicious. And what about your desserts? We have homemade cobblers that we change every couple of days. Delicious. And our lemon pie, which is outstanding. Got to taste it to believe it. And you also have a menu that caters to children called Little Dudes. What kinds of meals do you prepare for children? Sure, we have uh, plenty of good things on there for the kids. We have grilled cheese, we have hot dogs, we have great chicken nuggets. And of course, we do cater you know, to some parents, the parents' requests. We will try and do our best to accommodate. Tell me about your good for you section, your low calorie, low cholesterol, low fat entrees. We added the good for you section in response to the health consciousness that developed back during the mid 70s. Uh, old towns and affluent town. There are very a lot of people who are very health conscious aware. We offer a different entree every day, changes each day, that has been run through the uh, computer. So there is a printout of all the elements of the meal in terms of carbohydrates, proteins, fats, cholesterol, whatnot. So the diner can see exactly what they are getting. We emphasize freshness and good tasting, good for you foods too. Well, your menu is very well balanced. You have your classic comfort foods like your mashed potatoes, your grilled pork chops, but you also have those good for you foods, your black eyed pea salad, your grilled honey peppered chicken. You know, I'm gonna have a really tough time choosing just one entree from your menu. Yeah, it seems like this restaurant has something for everyone, great atmosphere, great service, and most of all, great people running it. Absolutely. Thank you. <laughs> well, Thank you. listen, thanks for having us today. Thank you for coming. Right. Thanks. Great. Our pleasure. And now we're gonna meet a family that dines here regularly. And also a family that has never dined here before. Can you imagine a family that's never dined here? No, but I think they're in for a treat. I agree. Let's go meet them. Okay, well. Shall we, uh, yeah, shall we start? Yeah, wonderful. <laughs> oh, I love your colored straws, by the way. The kids love them, too. Let's meet longtime King Street Blues regulars, the Hart family, and find out what keeps this happy family coming back. I've been coming to King Street Blues ever since it opened, several years ago. They have very good prices, and several of my kids have worked here over those years, and so we just keep coming back here, and it's a real pleasant experience. If I had to describe King Street Blues to someone who's never been here, I think I'd describe it as a fun diner, as a place where there's some entertainment uh, just by the atmosphere, um, and where the, the, uh, the food is like it is in a good diner. I like the people on the wall. I like the people on the wall. Uh, it's a wonderful atmosphere. It's a very, very comfortable, very good for our family. It's a, even though you have different levels of, of dining upstairs, we usually come upstairs and uh, we can bring our kids here and the uh, service is very responsive to children, children walking around. and. It's very nice. Uh, there's a lot of good beer here, good food, and I, and I enjoy all the, the people that I see when I come. For me, the food, the fun downstairs, and people who hang out. So it's a very friendly place. Uh, it's bright, uh, southern cuisine, um, nothing too heavy. It's not health food, but uh, it's stick to your ribs food, and you have a good time when you come. It's a neat looking place, good food, kids are welcome. It's a lot of fun.
Well, the Hart family seem to be very satisfied King Street Blues regulars. Yes, they do. And right now, we're going to meet a family that has never eaten here before and get their first time impression of King Street Blues. Come with us. Well, it's time for you to meet Reggie White and his family. Welcome to R&E and welcome to King Street Blues. Thank you, thank you very much. Reggie, why don't you introduce us to your family here? Okay, this is my daughter Shanti, Hello. my Hi. son Reggie Jr., and his friend Antoine Gaither. Hello. Hi. What's up? And what's your first impression of King Street Blues? I love it here, it's very nice. I think if you have the blues, this is a place to come to get rid of them. Sounds good. We're gonna go ahead and order our food, and while we're ordering, why don't you listen to this? I'll take a menu. Smith, and if you'd like to hear some more great blues music, come on down here and eat. King Street Blues offers live blues music for your enjoyment every other Thursday night. May as well come down and make an evening of it. Absolutely. And now we're going to find out what everyone ordered. Reggie, let's begin with you. I had the barbecue spare ribs. It was really good. The mahogany glaze made it excellent. It was really good. I had the southern fried catfish. It was gone within 30 seconds, so it must have been good. I had the basket of southern fried shrimp. It was very tasteful. I had the steak burger, and it was delicious. And how would you rate your first King Street Blues experience? Oh, it was really nice. It was very family-oriented. Uh, the service was great, and the food was excellent. OK, so you'll be coming back? Sure will. Oh, yeah. What did you say, guys? Yeah. And there you have it. Satisfied customers. Maria, I think we made a couple of more King Street Blues regulars and Reggie and his family here today. I think we did. Hey, thanks for being on the show. Yeah, Appreciate thanks. It. And now our r &E tour begins. After King Street Blues, we'll continue the tour of historic Old Town Alexandria, then over to Mount Vernon Avenue, and finally the West End of Alexandria. And then stop back here because we want to introduce you to the truly awesome management team here at King Street Blues. All right, let's dig in. interrupt our r &E tour to introduce you to our very special guest today, Herb Smith. Herb, thanks for taking time to perform for us here on r &E. It's great to be here. It's great our to pleasure. have you on the show, Herb. Yeah. How long have you been playing saxophone? Since I was about 14. Now, that hasn't been that long. <laughs> no, Ten not years that ago, long. So but maybe so. <laughs> <laughs> now, you have a very extensive background in music. Besides the sax, what do you play? I play flute, and I play clarinet, and I bang on the piano. And you have a band? Yes, I do. My band is uh, Confirmation. Okay, and tell us about your band. In the band we have on piano, Jerry Allen, who's been with us for quite a few years, and on drums, Bubbles Dean. And on bass, we now have uh, Dan LaMaestra. Great. Okay. Well, let's give them a plug. Where can they see you perform? Uh, they can see us uh, on Capitol Hill at a place called Truffles. And we're there every Friday night. That's every Friday this month? Every Friday, yes. Right. Great. Well, we'll stop by, check it out. Yes. Well, Excellent. thanks, Herb. 
We're certainly enjoying having you here. Yeah, thank you. All thank right. You. And our r and &E tour continues as we leave Old Town Alexandria and head on over to Mount Vernon Avenue. Then to the west end of Alexandria, finally back here to King Street Blues. We'll meet a group of hardworking people who help make King Street Blues so successful. So stay tuned. Can you entertain us? Calvert Grill at 3106 Mount Vernon Avenue in Alexandria, cooking up the very best American Grill daily. You don't have to spend a lot to eat well in Alexandria. That's why the Calvert Grill has been named one of Washingtonian Magazine's top 100 best bargain restaurants for the past four years. Calvert Grill's Southern American cuisine makes this American eatery one of the area's favorite neighborhood restaurants for singles and families with children. The Calvert Grill is a casual dining experience. Owners Don and Lynn Abram know what it takes to please their guests. Good food, friendly service, and very reasonable prices. Beer drinkers like the rotating assortment of microbrewery beers on tap and in bottles, and there are monthly beer or wine dinners. Children like the special kids menu in the family room. Tables are covered with white paper and a jar of crayons are on each table. Kids eat free every Monday and Tuesday night as well as on their birthday. This neighborhood restaurant is the Calvert Grill, and naturally, everybody loves the well-prepared food that the Calvert Grill serves up daily. Food like Calvert Grill's famous barbecued baby back ribs. Phyllis Richmond of the Washington Post says the ribs have a dry tenderness of well-smoked meat. Cilantro chicken marinated in lime juice and cilantro served over pasta. Or Kentucky bourbon steak marinated in bourbon, garlic, and ginger is flavorful and cooked to order. And if you want lighter fare, you can get a good old-fashioned thick cooked-to-order hamburger with french fries or barbecue pork or chicken, the best in town, made with our original southern red sauce. Desserts are always a must when dining at the grill, especially the chocolate peanut butter or key lime pie. Calvert Grill is open Monday through Thursday, 11 a.m. to 12.30 a.m., Friday, 11 a.m. to 2 a.m., Saturday, 10 a.m. to 12.30 a.m., and Sunday, 10 a.m. to 9 p.m. A private party room is available for special events, and off-site catering is offered for pickup or delivery. The Calvert Grill, where you'll find great food, reasonable prices, a neighborhood atmosphere, ample parking, and the regulars are greeted by name. Calvert Grill at 3106 Mount Vernon Avenue in Alexandria. Come see why you don't have to pay a lot to eat well in Washington at the Calvert Grill. West End Dinner Theater at 4615 Duke Street in the Fox Chase Shopping Center in the West End of Alexandria. Featuring a delicious meal along with a live stage performance. Enjoy an expertly prepared meal, then sit back, relax, and be entertained by a hit Broadway musical live on stage at the West End Dinner Theater, now celebrating their 11th season. West End Dinner Theater seats 380 and offers a festive theatrical atmosphere without the high cost. Every Tuesday through Sunday, the theater opens at 6 sharp as the dining room begins to serve dinner with full bar service available. Dinner at the theater is plentiful, offering full table service and your choice of entrees. The curtain goes up at 8 p.m. nightly with matinees on Wednesdays and Sundays. The stage at the West End Theater always comes to life with such hits as Meet Me in St. Louis, The Secret Garden, A Christmas Carol, and many more. West End is even producing children's theater with favorites like Snoopy, Rapunzel, and The Velveteen Rabbit. But West End Dinner Theater is more than just a great dinner theater. The facility can be booked for special events, luncheons, corporate meetings, even banquets. Host your group at the West End and get a great discount. Reserve for 20 or more people and you'll receive terrific savings. Come to the West End Dinner Theater this holiday season for the original musical version of Charles Dickens' A Christmas Carol, November 24th through December 23rd. Call the box office at 370-2500 for ticket information. The Dinner Theater has plenty of free, well-lit parking and is wheelchair accessible inside and out. 
For performance and ticket information, call the box office daily after 10 a.m. at 370-2500. And for local group sales, call 461-7834. For the best of Broadway, you must come to the area's largest dinner theater in the west end of Alexandria. We're just minutes from Old Town and D.C. and conveniently located in the Fox Chase Shopping Center on Duke Street. West End Dinner Theater, simply the best. Now you have two resources when it comes to restaurant and entertainment choices. That's right. You can watch the Jones Restaurant and Entertainment Guide here on Colonial Channel 10. Or when you're out and about, pick up your free copy of the Old Town Crier featuring the area's most extensive restaurant and entertainment listings. The Jones r &E Guide, bringing to your television screen a fine selection of restaurant and entertainment choices. And the Old Town Crier featuring area restaurants and a monthly entertainment calendar filled with fun things to do. Arnie and the Old Town Crier. Teaming up to make your life a lot easier. And coming this month, Christmas cash, something we could all use. And for more details on how you can earn Christmas cash, keep watching Jones Inner Cable for the participating Alexandria merchants. Christmas cash, a great way to start off the holiday season. Hey, Dave, what are you getting me this year? Yeah, that's a secret. But, Dave, you can tell me. I can keep a secret. Dave! There's a place in the heart of historic Old Town that's serving up great food and good times. That place is Bullfeathers, your classic restaurant and saloon celebrating 12 years in Alexandria. Bullfeathers executive chef Tom Lozapone is always cooking up something fresh and delicious, like homemade lobster, shrimp and scallop linguine, and Virginia's best beef, along with the best American grill in Old Town. Select from one of our chef's daily specials, or dine on a Bullfeathers award-winning burger. Every day from 4.30 to 6.30 p.m., come in for a three-course early bull dinner special that includes appetizer, soup or salad, entree and dessert. Bull Feathers also offers the mini moose menu for children under 10, featuring yummy meals and refreshing beverages. Whatever you select, Bull Feathers' extensive menu is sure to satisfy you. The kitchen serves until 1 a.m. And Sunday wouldn't be Sunday without treating yourself to a Bull Feathers Sunday brunch, 10 a.m. through 3 p.m. every Sunday. Select from our Bully Brunch menu, offering a wide selection of omelets, Belgian waffles, prime rib hash, eggs benedict, and much more. Bullfeather's Sunday Brunch also features Old Town's best Bloody Mary bar. And seven days a week, select from Bullfeather's wine list. Order select white and red wines, champagnes, as well as Bullfeather's own private label. Come alone, bring a friend or the entire family and dine in our spacious dining room or pull up a stool and enjoy a rousing time at the bar, which is open until 2 a.m. daily. Bullfeathers also offers a private dining room called the Virginia Room, which can be reserved for special events. The Virginia Room will accommodate large groups. Bullfeathers wants you to celebrate with us. Bullfeathers also caters, offering you an exciting alternative by combining our service experience with the purchasing power of our restaurant. Our catering professionals will fulfill your catering needs, meet your budget, and do it with style. Give us a call at 836-8088 to reserve the Virginia Room. There's something for everyone at Bullfeathers, located at 112 King Street in Old Town. Bilbo Baggins Wine Cafe and Restaurant at 208 Queen Street in Old Town, Alexandria. Featuring creative American cuisine with a European flair. There's a cozy local gathering place with tasty, unusual wines, beers, and friendly service. That place is Bilbo Baggins Restaurant right in Old Town, Alexandria. Bilbo Baggins tries to be more than a restaurant. It sets out to be your friend, offering a warm and friendly greeting. The dining rooms are indeed cozy. The downstairs dining room walls are rough pine and aged brick, and the windows stretch from floor to ceiling. There are large tables for groups, stained glass windows, and upstairs are three murals painted by a local artist. These include one of Bilbo Baggins and his hobbit companions, along with two other murals depicting a vineyard and grape motif. Bilbo's extensive menu includes linguine with seafood, made with fresh clams, mussels, shrimp, scallops, calamari, and crab meat, served with marinara sauce. Sirloin topped with house-made boisin, just to name a few. And you must leave room for a house-made dessert made fresh daily right on the premises. Bilbo Baggins pays serious attention to wine and beer, and the list encompasses everything, offering 32 wines by the glass and 10 fresh micro-brews on tap. Phyllis Richmond, food critic for the Washington Post, says, Whatever your mood, Bilbo Baggins intends to satisfy it. There's a list of weekday discounts, a quarterly newsletter, and a questionnaire. And after lunch, the waiter presents you with a free lunch break card, offering a free entree after five visits. 
The attention doesn't stop there. After dinner one evening, the hostess let us take home one of the leftover loaves of bread. It's like going home for the holidays. Bilbo Baggins does these things with a special zest. The bread basket includes fat slabs from a big, crusty loaf of cracked wheat raisin bread, as well as the day's special. Bilbo Baggins Wine Cafe and Restaurant is located at 208 Queen Street in Old Town, Alexandria, and is open for lunch and dinner seven days a week. Geranio Ristorante at 722 King Street in Old Town, Alexandria, offering fine Italian cuisine. Geranio Ristorante owner and chef Lucio Bergaman has been cooking up Italian favorites in Old Town since 1976. Executive chef Freddy Gonzalez and manager Manuel Cruz have been with Geranio since 1978. The family-like staff has been with Geranio for over 15 years, so it's no wonder Geranio Ristorante is by far one of the more popular dining places in town. Geranio's dining rooms are charming and cozy with Italian tile floors, whitewashed walls, fresh cut flowers on every table, and the friendliest staff around. Geranio's is famous for seasonal favorites like soft shell crabs and steamed mussels, grilled lobster with seafood linguine, roasted quail, and sausages. Agnolotti is homemade pasta pillows stuffed with spinach and ricotta cheese served in a light cream sauce. And Linguini Genovese is linguine with homemade pesto garlic, olive oil, and basil, fresh from Lucio's garden. But Geranio offers a wide selection of northern Italian favorites. Veal, chicken, game, pasta, fresh seafood, and every order is prepared fresh from the kitchen. Geranio's is also very health conscious and offers a special dine to your heart's content menu that includes low cholesterol, heart healthy dishes. Geranio's wine cellar is fully stocked with fine and reasonably priced Italian and California wines and has received favorable reviews by all major papers and magazines. Washingtonian and Gazette Packet picked Geranio's as one of the best restaurants of Alexandria. New Dominion Magazine says Geranio's is one of the top restaurants in Northern Virginia and Crystal City Magazine writes Geranio's is a healthy place to dine. Geranio's Ristorante Lunch is served Monday through Friday 11.30 a.m. to 2.30 p.m. Dinner Monday through Saturday 6 to 10.30 p.m. And Sunday dinner is 5.30 p.m. to 9.30 p.m. and has metered street parking and many above ground as well as underground parking garages nearby. Geranio Ristorante in Historic Old Town is located at 722 King Street. Come dine with us the next time you're in Old Town or give us a call at 548-0088. Looking for a place with good eats? You know, comfort food at comfortable prices? There's an exciting and popular Virginia Roadhouse right in Old Town, King Street Blues. Phyllis Richmond, restaurant critic of the Washington Post, says King Street Blues is more than a restaurant. It's sort of a three-story neighborhood, a neon-decorated roadhouse that cooks the classics of the 50s and 60s. King Street Blues features southern regional favorites like delicious barbecued chicken and the best house-smoked baby back ribs in Virginia, both covered with their own favorite barbecue sauce, which you can even take with you. And just look at the size of that meatloaf, served with their very popular garlic mashed potatoes. You'll come for the fun, but stay for the food. The extensive menu includes a host of appetizers and light fare, like the American nachos, hot legs, and fresh cut fries. Entrees include Virginia native beef stew and three-way noodles, which go especially well with their custom-brewed hogwash root beer. The menu also includes salads, like the black-eyed pea salad piled high on a bed of fresh vegetables. The grilled chicken and vegetable salad is a fresh grilled breast of chicken atop crisp garden vegetables. Try one of our sandwiches, such as the Chicken Club, Famous Wet Willy, and the Smoked Turkey BLT. End your meal with one of King Street's delicious fresh-baked desserts. And our new menu features daily, low-fat, low-calorie, and low-cholesterol entrees that are good and good for you. Before or after your meal, or just for a good time, come in and enjoy King Street's specially brewed beverages in an inviting, fun-filled atmosphere for singles and families alike. King Street Blues is located at 112 North St. Asaph Street. So come on down and find out what Roadhouse Modern is all about. King Street Blues now has the best down-home breakfast in town, starting at 10.30 a.m. on Sundays only. We're open daily, so give King Street Blues a call, 836-8800. King Street Blues' success is due to a strong team of hardworking, dedicated, and very talented people, and we'd like to introduce you to that team one-on-one. -on -one. That's right. We want to introduce you to them all in this very special interview. So sit back and get ready to meet Janie, Bob, Dave, Elizabeth, the whole gang here at King Street Blues. Enjoy the interview.
Every Sunday we have the Redskins on. We gotta have the Redskins. Um, and what tonight, or actually, we'll be we show all the big events, uh, World Series, NBA championships. If there's a game on, we're gonna have it on at King Street Blues. I think what keeps customers coming back is King Street Blues as a whole. Um, we don't just have bar regulars. We don't just have restaurant regulars. Um, our patrons go to both the bar and the restaurant. They enjoy everything about it. They enjoy everything from the food to the atmosphere to management to the employees. I think it is, as a whole, our customers appreciate the restaurant in general. Uh, Monday through Friday from 4 to 7, uh, we pour pitchers of our draft beer, 32-ounce pitchers. We sell them for four dollars and fifty cents, so it's uh, it's a savings on two beers, about two and a half beers. Yeah. Uh, we do cheap eats. We do twenty-five cent mini shredded pork barbecue sandwiches. We do a dollar plate for nachos, and we do barbecue ribs for uh, for a buck a piece. Um, the artwork um, is a constant, ongoing thing here. Um, a lot of it was done. Um, the large pieces were done by Brian McCall. He did all the really wild characters and he also did the um, large colorful murals and things. And then um, we also feature some local artists or some local talent around the room. Um, and you know, that's constantly changing. It's, it's not gonna be a set thing. You'll see different pieces move, you'll see new pieces come in, you'll see pieces go out. We do live music down here in the bar every Thursday night. Um, some of it is blues, some of it is more progressive, some is a little bit um, in between that, some is jazzy. Uh, we try a different group each Thursday, and um, they bring a little bit uh, of different music to it. There is no cover. Um, it's simply just have a good time. You can go upstairs and sit down. You can sit down here in the bar. You can hear the music all over. Well, we have two TVs here in the bar, and so we really can accommodate, obviously, some various tastes because we can put different games or, or whatever's happening on, on both TVs, and so we can make pretty much everybody happy. Oh, we watch Melrose here, and we get we get a big crowd. It's a lot of fun. It's a good breakfast. It's it's basic. We serve both lunch and breakfast on Sunday mornings, and our breakfast just consists mainly of eggs and pancakes and um, egg sandwiches. And it's it's very basic. It's it's great. We have um, a couple novel items on there, and then dewy hash um, and dewy sausage with the spicy sausage, and that's great because with toast eggs. Um, the sandwiches are uh, white cheddar cheese and egg with uh, bacon or sausage, either choice, and they come with our hash browns. You can get eggs any way you want, and they come with hash browns and a biscuit and some sausage or bacon if you want. And we also have an omelet, and you can get anything you want in that. We're open from Monday through Saturday at 11.30 until 5 for lunch, and on Sunday we open up at 10.30 until 4. And we start dinner at 5 p.m., and on Sunday we start dinner at 4 p.m. We serve until 10 o'clock on Sunday, Monday through Thursday till 10.30, Friday and Saturday till 11.30. King Street Blues is located at 112 North St. Asaph Street in Alexandria, Old Town. Okay. Well, Maria, it's easy to see why customers keep coming back. King Street Blues is a winner. The staff and management are doing a superb job. Keep